Assalamualaikum hi guys welcome back to my channel so today plan is I'm gonna be riding towards Port Patek it's 94 mile from Glasgow and it's showing me it will take up to 2 hours and 20 minutes for me to get there so stay with me and enjoy the ride so one issue is that that I am leaving in rush hour right now which is coming up 5 o'clock here but again it's a very very nice day here today and I don't want to miss this day I was thinking of going somewhere nearby but I could not think of anywhere so it's my first solo ride so today I planned that I'm gonna do it myself first time since I bought this motorbike it's my first time I'm going alone I'm a bit nervous because I have not ridden that far myself on my bike so you can see on the right hand side this is all the traffic coming towards Glasgow and uh, which is kind of standstill so you can see that we can see the sign of Kilmarnock and uh, but don't worry we're gonna catch this traffic as well so if you're new to my channel please like share and subscribe to my channel I'm too much tempted to do some filtering and I'm gonna do it now so guys we are near Kilmarnock and uh, we're still on the motorway but I don't understand why there's a lot of traffic here again so everything is stopped here and uh, this does not look good because I have got limited time again and I want to come back and it's just like two and a half hour ride back but if you're gonna be like this I don't think I will be able to go all the way towards Port Partick to be very honest so after hanging about in the traffic for that long I've decided to filter through these lanes because this traffic is not moving I don't know if there is accident or this is something usual here every day but I have to kind of decide what I have to do either I stuck here or just head on so this is what I'm doing uh, filtering through but anyway I would recommend people who are willing to travel this time that better you stay home this one is not the travel time if you want to go somewhere this is not the time you want to travel to because look the traffic is stopping again so latest update of the traffic is that we are still stuck on the motorway and I'm sure there must be an accident somewhere because this is not possible that we are driving about 10 miles an hour and sometime we are not riding at all it's just like everything is stopped and I can see some flashing lights so I'm not sure if there is an accident over here or it's just like a police stop people here I don't know what's going on here so we will go by it and see it very soon uh, because this traffic is just like ridiculous I don't know if you can see on the camera or not uh, I filtered through most of the traffic but it's still it's been half an hour there you can see it's not just one police car there is one two three there's a lot of police car three police cars and you can see this car which is crashed two cars have been crashed and they are clearing the roads you can see there two cars have been crashed we have entered South Ayrshire Council and uh, this is the average speed camera zone and here the average speed is 50 mile an hour and we are quite near to Preswick Airport so you can see there are a couple of bikers which are in front of me 
and they overtook me guys check out this view now look like a small wee ruins of any castle on the left on your left hand side that look like ruins of some castle I'm not sure if you can go there or not I think you can so there you go now you can see the coastline in front of us so that was the thing I was missing and finally we have came across the coastline and it's beautiful and we have entered the town of Tunbury as you can see the sun is shining and uh, we are at the coastline that was the thing I was looking at for and I came all this way from Glasgow to capture that coastline I'm not sure what is this rock in the middle it's a small island but what's the name of it I'm not sure what is this windmill doing here alone so we are going through the small town of Gerwin you see it's a nice day and a lot of people came out you will see a lot of bikers on this side as well I think a lot of people who live around about these areas they most of them are bikers so that look like the main street of Gerwin because I can see boots here I can see is a bank of Scotland was there Greg's is here there's a Morrison here as well I want to ride towards as far as I can I thought it might be a small village but it's not a village it's a small town a lot of people have stopped there near to the coastline because there's a car park here one side is the mountains and the next side is the sea what a combination I'm a big fan of Scotland beauty now and I'll tell you one more thing these roads are absolutely beautiful I have not hit a single pothole so far finger crossed so a bit chilly here because of the coastline I think this is one of the good thing as well that so many speed cameras are here and that will help people to not drive or ride crazy oh so nice man look at that so beautiful so most of the ride is guys now next to this coastline I'm not sure that if we're gonna be heading to Port Partick today and the reason is the time oh my god he scared me you know what I was enjoying the scenery and some people they just enjoying the ride 
look at that so gorgeous man so beautiful my god this is so beautiful highlight of the day is this this is the highlight of today and i want to show the world the beauty of scotland not how fast you can ride on these roads yeah these roads are good for bikers because they are bendy they are they are they are beautiful there is no potholes then people will say my vlogs are too long how can i cut this scenery tell me i got few bikers behind me and i think they're going to overtake me so i will let them overtake i think they are all on harleys there's a big group coming i can hear them oh my god so beautiful this is can you hear them there's one going by me and there's a woman and there's a lot of them they all go by me there's second there's third I'm gonna cut this from from a vlog. Tell me, please. Can somebody comment and tell me that is this scenery supposed to be off from the vlog because then vlog gone gonna go 20 minutes and nobody want to watch that. Who does not want to watch that? I'm so proud to live in Scotland. What a small beautiful country it is. You know what? I'm not going to cut this. If somebody want to watch it, they're going to enjoy it. If somebody don't want to watch it, as always they can skip it. But this is not something I should edit. That's why I always ask you guys that please comment and let me know that how I can make my vlogs a bit better for you and what do you want to see There's a big lorry and he can't wait. Look at that. Look at him. Now I can see more often parking spots. Guys, check this out. Look at this guys. I hope my camera is doing the justice with this place. This is absolutely stunning guys. Look at this view. Look here on the right hand side. Mountain and then sea. That's another small village. Most of the houses here are like bungalow type houses.
so we are going through a nice wee hilly area and we can see the coastline again which is up here so these roads are really bendy now slow down a bit from here so now we are going through a mountain What do you think guys? I think we go back. And I have decided that I'm gonna go towards Port Partick some other day when it's more I've got more time because we are coming towards the sunset time very soon. Oh my god, look at this man. Look at this. have camping gear or whatever in the car camp camper vans are here so we're gonna stop here for a bit and gonna fly a drone from here so guys I'm leaving Gerwin now I've taken some pictures it was amazing sunset so the Sun is set now and uh, and and it will be starting to get dark very soon so I'm not sure uh, how the camera quality gonna be at night time because I've never recorded anything at night time there was a sharp bend I didn't realize that so if you have enjoyed this video so far Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. So I would say it was a very good riding experience for me overall because that was my first solo ride since I bought the bike. So this is a harbor here. You can see the harbor. It's too late now at dark. So guys I'm gonna say goodbye to you and please like share and subscribe to my channel and look after yourself and thanks for staying with me bye bye